Hello and welcome to our video on the German Shepherd and Belgian Malinois breeds. Both breeds are known for their loyalty, intelligence, and trainability, making them popular choices for working dogs and family pets. In this video, we will compare the German Shepherd and Belgian Malinois breeds, discussing their histories, personalities, health concerns, grooming needs, and training requirements to help you decide which breed is the best fit for your family. Part 1. History and Characteristics the German Shepherd is a breed that originated in Germany in the late 19th century. Originally bred as a working dog, German Shepherds were used for herding, guarding, and as police and military dogs. German Shepherds are medium to large sized dogs, weighing between 50 to 90 pounds and standing 22 to 26 inches tall. They have a thick, dense coat that comes in a variety of colors, including black, tan, and sable. German Shepherds have a powerful, muscular build with a broad chest and a long, straight back. The Belgian Malinois is a breed that originated in Belgium in the 1800s. Originally bred as a herding dog, Belgian Malinois have also been used as police and military dogs. Belgian Malinois dogs, Belgian Malinois are medium-sized dogs, weighing between 40 to 80 pounds and standing 22 to 26 inches tall. They have a short, straight coat that comes in a variety of colors, including fawn, red, and mahogany. Belgian Malinois have a lean, athletic build with a deep chest and a strong, agile body. Part 2. Temperament German Shepherds are known for their intelligence, loyalty, and protectiveness. They are highly trainable and excel in obedience, agility, and herding. German Shepherds are also very active and require daily exercise to keep them physically and mentally healthy. They're protective of their families and can be wary of strangers, making them excellent guard dogs. However, this can also lead to aggression if they are not socialized properly. Belgian Malinois are also known for their intelligence, loyalty, and trainability. They are highly active and require daily exercise to keep them healthy and happy. Belgian Malinois are protective of their families and can be wary of strangers, making them excellent guard dogs. They are also more high-strung than German Shepherds and can become destructive if they are not given enough exercise and mental stimulation. Part 3. Health Both German Shepherds and Belgian Malinois are generally healthy breeds, but they are prone to certain health issues. German Shepherds are prone to hip dysplasia, a condition that can cause pain and mobility problems. They are also prone to bloat, a life-threatening condition where the stomach twists on itself. Belgian Malinois are prone to hip dysplasia as well, and they are also prone to eye problems, such as cataracts and progressive retinal atrophy. Part 4. Grooming German Shepherds have a thick double coat that sheds heavily twice a year. They require regular brushing to keep their coat healthy and to reduce shedding. Belgian Malinois have a short, straight coat that requires minimal grooming. Both breeds require regular nail trimming and dental care to keep them in good health. Part 5. Training Both German Shepherds and Belgian Malinois are highly trainable breeds that excel in obedience and agility. Positive reinforcement training methods, such as rewards and praise, work well with both breeds. However, both breeds require early socialization to prevent aggression towards other animals and people. Training should be consistent and ongoing to keep these breeds mentally stimulated and well-behaved in. Part 6. Which is the best family dog? When it comes to choosing between a German Shepherd and a Belgian Malinois as a family dog, both breeds have their pros and cons. German Shepherds are larger and have a more laid-back personality, which can make them a good fit for families with children. They are also easy to train and have a strong protective instinct, which can make them excellent watchdogs. Belgian Malinois, on the other hand, are smaller and more active than German Shepherds, making them a good fit for families who are active and enjoy outdoor activities. They are also highly trainable and have a strong work ethic, which can make them excellent at tasks such as search and rescue, detection work, and obedience competitions. However, it's important to note that both breeds require a significant amount of training and exercise to stay happy and healthy. They are also known for their high energy levels, so families with young children or elderly individuals may find them to be too energetic or even overwhelming. Overall, the best breed for your family will depend on your lifestyle, personality, and preferences. It's important to research both breeds and consider the pros and consider the pros and cons of each before making a decision. Additionally, it's important to choose a reputable breeder and to socialize and train your dog from a young age to ensure that they are well-behaved and well-adjusted. 
In conclusion, both German Shepherds and Belgian Malinois can make great family dogs, but it's important to choose the breed that is the best fit for your lifestyle and family. With proper training, socialization, and care, either breed can make a wonderful and loyal companion for years to come.